Well, a very good morning to you. Have your days off to a good start. It is that time of year, second weekend, when gym memberships skyrocket and healthy food re-enters the kitchen with the most popular New Year's resolution being to lose weight. But with so much conflicting advice out there, it is hard to know which diet will work for you. Well, this morning, we have a very personal account from our very own Shelley Horton, who says she has tried it all and has recently had great success. And I'm happy to say we're joined now by Shelley and nutritionist Jamie Rose Chambers. Good morning to you both. Good morning. morning. Shelley, I read this article on Nine Hut Honey uh, yeah. this morning. It's really powerful and very personal. Uh, t- talk us through your journey. Okay, so the bit that I was talking about on Nine Honey was the fact that five years ago I actually had gastric lap banding surgery and it failed. I didn't lose weight on it. I vomited all the time and I was hungry all the time and quite miserable. And so I actually had a second operation to have it removed. Mm. And I didn't tell anyone because I was so ashamed. And I think that there's a lot of shame when you fail at weight loss. Mm. And I've now found that a lot of people, the gastric lap banding doesn't work for them. Um, So I kind of wanted to have the skeleton out of the closet Mm. and say, it's okay to fail, just try something else. Yeah, well done. Well, you've lost 13 kilograms in, what, four months? Yeah. Uh, Obviously not from the lap band, so tell us how you did it. (laughs) So it was sort of middle of last year and I got diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. So I think having a bit of a health shock is often when people make a big change like this. So it was at that time that I heard about Superfast Diet and the fa- it's a fabulous program with two Aussie women who've created it, Jen Davidson and Victoria Black. And it's based on the science of intermittent fasting. Mm. So for me, I've chosen to do what is a version of 5-2. So for two days of the week, I have 500 calories and the other day is up to yep. 2,000 calories, which is actually quite a lot. So you can still have wine. Yeah. So for yeah. me, <laughs> that makes me very happy. And I, I've just found that I can do this because for me, it's not that relentless, constant calorie restriction. Yep. It's like stunt dieting. Yep. Yeah. And yeah, 13 kilos down. I'm, I'd like to lose another seven and the health benefits have been Amazing. Yeah. Well, the turnaround from type 2 diabetes is incredible. Amazing. Well done, yeah. Shelley. Yes. That's, that's, I mean, you look amazing, and it is amazing. Well done. Jamie, the 5-2 diet, I mean, there's various forms of that. Tell us a little bit more about the intermittent uh, dieting and the various various other ones you can try. Yeah, that's right. There's a number of different methods of intermittent fasting. So you could fast for part of a whole day. So you'd fast for, say, eight, an eight-hour window. Or you could fast like Shelley does on yep. certain days of the week, so two days or three days a week. So you can really be quite flexible with it. You can work it into your, your lifestyle and what suits you, and it's really just about what's sustainable for you. Is one form of fasting or intermittent fasting more effective than the others? The research is showing no, that really any type of fasting is beneficial for your health. Now, uh, obviously, um, this is something, Shelley, you've struggled with for some time. Yeah. The, it's, it's one thing to get it off. Yeah. To keep it off yeah. is the ongoing challenge. Tell us about that. So the amazing thing for me is I, so I've lost 13 kilos so far and I just had uh, another round of blood tests. Yep. Mm. And I've been insulin resistant for about 25 years and then I had the recent diagnosis of type yep. 2 diabetes. I'm no longer insulin resistant. I no longer have type 2 diabetes. And the amazing thing is, too, I've lost 15 centimetres off my waist, which you may think is just makes you look skinny, but in fact, that's the dangerous fat. That's the visceral fat that's around your organs. Mm. So my doctor, when she got my results, actually did a happy dance. <laughs> so, and I did too. Well, you look <laughs> fabulous. You look happy and you look healthy. Yes. Um, how do you feel on the inside? I actually feel really proud of myself. Yeah. And I've was very nervous coming out and telling everyone about this because there's so much scrutiny, but I actually wanted to say that I felt happy and I felt healthy yeah. and I'm not at goal weight yet, so imagine how healthy I'm going to be yeah. when I get yeah, there. Exactly. And I feel like my insides are getting healthier. And Jamie, there's a lot of other science between um, intermittent fasting that's not just weight loss. Yeah. Well, we would love to chat further about it, yeah. but we are out of time. Um, and of course, as always, if you do want to get involved in something like this, you should speak to your GP first. Of course. But you are living and wonderful proof um, that Find it can work. Find what suits you. Exactly Find right. Find what suits you. Exactly right. And I know that it was nerve-wracking for you yeah. to speak about something so personal. <laughs> but thank you for sharing it, because yeah, I know that it will you. motivate and inspire many people watching at home this morning, too. Thanks for your support. Good on you, Shelley. Well done. Thanks, Jamie. Really Great stuff. Well, ahead in the news, big news, Craig McLaughlin.